Okay guys, I've been looking forward to this song for the whole album. This one's called Eminem Head Honcho featuring Easy Mill, one of my favorite rappers of all time, a rapper that I personally reacted to when I very first started YouTube. And Easy Mill basically built my channel, guys. You know, the, the beautiful Pinoy people, the beautiful people of the Philippines, guys, they helped elevate my channel to a, a massive level. So I appreciate that so much. This is also from the death of Slim Shady Coupe de Gras. I cannot wait for this, guys. Okay, Easy Mill got signed to Eminem, Shady Aftermath Records, Interscope Records. You guys all know about that. And I was like on a 10 high, guys. I told you, when Easy Mill drops this album that he's gonna drop for the first time on Shady Records, it might be the biggest album of all time, guys. It might it might even be uh, 50 Cent's Get Rich or Die Trying. It might beat all those albums, guys. I personally think that. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below, man. Like, this has got to be one of the best songs on the album, and I haven't listened to it yet, guys. No cap, I haven't listened to it yet. Okay, I'm going through the album in order. Okay, so I got about four songs left, including this one. So let's get straight to it, guys. Make sure to comment down below. Easy Mill is the go. Eminem's the go. Two legends, man. Come on, apparently he raps in his own language here as well, which is gonna be just wild, guys. Come on. I'm my best, just to not blow my cover. No, it's all just a test, but I can't pass up this hunger. There's still a hole in my chest, and I'm trying to strap it with numbers. All you hoes got your checks, but I'm a queen when I run up. Cross a king with my hunters, shooting threes in abundance. Rookie G's Ooh. acting thuggish, he points to me, shut the fuck up. Annihilations, whoa. Bro, hold on, hold on. He's rapping his ass off here, guys. Chess, checkers, I'm playing chess, playing checkers. Let's go, man, this is fire. Shooting threes in abundance. Rookie G's acting thuggish. He points to me, shut the fuck up. Annihilation's what we love. Steady hitting, getting duds. Just wait till we get the guns out. 45 na calibre o 9. Kau na bahala sa dinami. Rami mong mali. Utak mo lang may tama. Sa titig mong isip pare. Nakamalang na ban at naglalim-laliman. Ang sarap mong ilublub sa dagat. Di ka lang ang magpatunay sa sino man na nakikinig. Di masasalag ng sentido o ng iyong bibig. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta break this one down, guys, because I got the lyrics here, man, and it actually has the translation on Genius. Like, we have to see the translation to that, guys. We can't go past that without the translation. 45 caliber or 9, it's up to you. Out of your out of your many mistakes, only your brain is right. With your narrow thinking, you couldn't even respond. Delving depths, it feels good to dip you in the sea. No need to prove to anyone who's listening. It cannot be detected by the senses or your mouth. That's pretty cool. You know what's crazy, guys? Like, to have Easy Mill on the album, like Eminem doesn't have to put Easy Mill on this album, guys. Like Eminem is so big, like he's such a famous rapper that he doesn't have to put uh, Easy Mill on the album, but he does that, guys, to help elevate Easy Mill's career as well. So crazy, guys. That's pretty fire. Pretty loyal, loyal guy. <laughs> That's sick. I'm the I'm the head honcho. I get the money, get the bread pronto. I get the money pronto. That's fire. Damn, bro. Easy Mill singing the hook as well. Bro, this is fire. I love this, man. Easy Mill is a ledge, man. His voice was like made for rap music. And obviously, he's like come from the, the Philippines all the way to America, guys, to do music. It's just like... The guy's living the dream, guys. Like he is literally living the dream, guys. It's unbelievable. Got loose grips, too grip. That's the shit I'm smooth with. I'm the new Ooh. kid that these fathers can't fool with. Shit, my new slips. I tighter than how these boots fit. I got that new drip that drowns Titanic or cruise ships. Don't Ooh. you dip and dab it. That was fire. I got the new drip that drowned Titanic or cruise ships. Bro, his style is so sick that it could sink a cruise ship. Bro, let's go, baby. This is sick, bro. Easy Mill is just, he's so, like, smooth and just chill and just, bro, I think he, like, commented on the channel before, like, like yo, I love this reaction, bro, like, keep it up. Bro, I'm big fan of Easy Mill. I'm a day one Easy Mill. I was one of the first people to react to Easy Mill, man. Ever on YouTube, man. These boots fit, I got that new drip that drowns Titanic or cruise ships. Don't you dip and dab too close, just watch us from a distance. I don't fuck with all that glucose, you fall in need assistance. I could do the same, but who knows? I'd rather say good riddance, Jack the Ripper, ripping paroles and not. Hold on, hold on, he said, you don't dip and dab too close, I don't F with all that glucose. So, dip and dab is like the, the sweets, you know? He said, I don't mess with all that sugar, but it's because obviously sugar is like cancer. Bro, that's fire. People don't even catch that bar, man, you know? People don't even catch that, man. Dip and dab is like a sweet. It raises your 
you know, your insulin, it obviously is like a sweet, that's class. Don't you dip and dabble too close, just watch us from a distance. I don't fuck with all that glucose, you fall in need assistance. I could do the same, but who knows? I'd rather say your riddance, Jack the Ripper, ripping paroles, annihilate Damn. with persistence. I try to say something different, but by today, I'm just spitting to ride while making a living. But mama say that I'm different, she proud of how I do business. I kind of resemble Hitman, they got away from the killing. I'm the oh, head honcho, money yeah, that's from my flow, the clip Bro, that's fire, man. Hit his lyrics and voice his voice is so clear concise like he's just hitting you with bars 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 guys fire man you know and last time easy mill and eminem were on a song together a lot of reactors and i won't name names because we all know but you know a lot of reactors were like oh like easy mill didn't come with the fire he came with the fire today guys like that was sick you know obviously when you rap with eminem eminem always tries to outdo his people on the track but that was sick guys. i love that they call me the boss though, you can call me Marshall I get the oh. bread pronto You don't relate to me, guess you never been angry or sad Or maybe oh. just have, never had to face any adversity Take any ass whippings oh. I basically had To see some shit that it make you faint like you're faking the jab Bitch you wish you had a life oh. Bro, that is so sick bro I think I know what he's talking about guys so he said, to see some shit that make you faint like you're faking a jab. He could be talking about people fainting, taking the you-know-what, guys. You don't even know, man. Eminem's on his crazy. This album is like crazy, guys. He's a lot of deep meanings in this album, guys. A lot of deep meanings in this album, bro. Basically had to see some shit that it make you faint like you're faking the jab. Pussy. Bitch, you wish you had a life like mine. Yeah. You just fantasize the shit you write. You guys like lying. Yeah. Everything you ever been through multiplied by nine. What? Ain't even half the shit I went through by the time I was five. Like what? So my uncle gets stabbed, took a knife right in the abs. Yeah. And all he was trying to do was get my tricycle back. Yeah, the one that Boogie, Malcolm, and Isaac just jacked after that. They jumped me and stumped me and hit me twice with a bat Was five and a half, second time I survived an attack Two twins, they called themselves the Bulldogs White kids and fat, I was too frightened to scrap I didn't fight a hit back And you wonder why is it that I treat a mic like a gay Oh my Christ, bro This is the best album Eminem's ever put out This is the best album Eminem has ever put out, bro Like he's talking about all the struggles he had growing up in his life He said you haven't match any of the any of the stuff that I've gone through even by the time I was five I saw my uncle take a knife in the abs he said then I, by the time I was what 10 he said I was beaten up guys I survived I survived an attack I was five and a half I survived an attack getting beaten up by by two white bullies he said and you wonder why that I treat a mic like a gat that's sick I was too frightened to scrap I didn't fight or hit back that's why I treat the mic like a gat and that's one of the whole things with Eminem guys like his whole persona Eminem is like he uses the microphone to give him strength and, you know, build himself up. And obviously, guys, I don't listen to music for anything but, like, you know, hitting the gym and stuff, right? So you use music for different, to make you feel empowered, you know what I mean? And a lot of people use music for different things, like to relax themselves, whatever. But I use Eminem's music to get me fired up to work out, guys. It is nothing better, guys. This stuff is... It's hard hitting, bro. I must survived an attack. Two twins, they called themselves the Bulldogs. White kids and fat. I was too frightened to scrap. I didn't fight a hit back. And you wonder Damn. why is it that? I treat a mic like a gaddy yeah. yeah. When I pull it, a bullet from out of barrel. The size of a derringer flies. That's how I would characterize lyrics. But America, I could see the fear in your eyes. You saw my terrible Ooh. side. The blonde hair and blue eyes. Yes. Now the writing is on the wall. The graffiti still. If you're having trouble reading, will make it simple. He's easy kill. Easy name. Oh, that's sick. That's sick. Now the writing's on the wall like graffiti still. If you're still having trouble, we'll make it simple. It's easy kill. So that's obviously Easy Mill's full name. That's crazy, guys. The writing's on the wall. Basically saying, like, Easy Mill is solidified in the rap game, guys. He's going to be one of the biggest. It's on the wall like graffiti still. If you're having trouble reading, we'll make it simple. He's easy kill. Easy name to remember because his rap name is the same. It's like 10 minutes on stages for me. Easy Mill. Or should I say me? Oh. Oh my god, bro. That was a bar. He said his name is like me rapping on stage for 10 minutes. Easy mill. Basically, it's an easy way to make a million dollars, right? Oh, that's fire. That is fire, bro. Eminem is his syllables, easy mill, easy kill, easy deal. Like it's such a his syllables in this album are the best I've ever seen in my whole entire life, guys. There's nothing that even comes close. Any of his albums, guys. It's this is crazy. This is ridiculous. Rap name is the same as like 10 minutes on stages for me. Oh. Easy meal, or should I say measly meal? Yeah, cause this sure is mm. my used to feed me. Sleep 
sleeping pills to keep me sleepy still it was creepy because the Nietzsche could have easily Casey Anthony need me these rappers I'm above them but punching down ain't beneath me no cold as the mm. wind chill factor but the fact is I don't know when to chill but every time oh, I come the out they expect me to fucking reinvent the wheel rappers get praised for spitting bars with less than the tenth of skill embers bro that's sick that's sick that's sick bro he said every time I come out Rappers want me to reinvent the freaking wheel. Like, they want me to be, like, the top, top of the thing because, I obviously, that's what I'm used to. But he said, rappers get praised for spitting bars with one-tenth of the skill. That's true, guys. You listen to a bunch of mumble rappers nowadays, and it's like, wow. I'm out, they expect me to fucking reinvent the wheel. Rappers get praised for spitting bars with less than a tenth of skill. Imbecile on the ledge like a benzoyl pill on the windowsill. Now, canceled ain't the word for me. You need a term that's probably stronger than dirty laundry. Damn. This controversy got me. <laughs> Dirty Laundry Hill. Shout out to Lauren Hill. He always talks about how he uh, he he, uh, he uh, tried to pick up Lauren Hill. That's one of his bars. In right? the worst of quandaries, feel like the Earth's axis, the world's turning on me. Like them cops in Akron, Ohio, with Jalen Walker, and caught this much flack in a while since back as a child. And all I did was say like one thing bad, then it spiraled. Saw you cracking a smile, then relapsed in the mile. Ways back in the vial. Guess there ain't no civilizing a savage, and I don't give a fuck. That's fire. So yeah, he said like, you know, I, I ain't caught this much flack in a while since I was a child. All I did was say one bad thing, then it spiraled. Basically, he just said the anti-Trump stuff, right? Right? He basically just said, um, oh, that's cool. He, he uh, wordplay with spiraled and saw referencing 2001 film starring Chris Rock. I love that. I love that movie. There's a new movie with Chris Rock and Samuel L. Jackson. It's like the book of Saw, it's called. But he said that what he talks about is... Um, I spiraled after the one bad thing. The one bad thing that he said was like, he dissed Trump, you know, he was all for a, a different movement, like, and everyone went crazy. But the thing is, guys, Eminem hated all the flipping presidents. You know, he can't really hate all the presidents and then turn around and say, oh, I like this president. That would be like hella hypocritical, right? So I understand why he did that, right? And all I did was say like one thing bad, then it spiraled. Saw you cracking a smile, then relapsed in the mile. Way is back in the vial. Guess there ain't no civilizing a savage, and I don't give a fuck if you hate me worse than these track on revival. Bitch, I'm back like a spinal. Get it cracking like Kairos. It's the coup de gras. I'm cooler than removing claws from a cougar's paws and throwing it back in the wild. But you taming me ain't gonna happen in aisle. Live on planet denial for the rest of my life, but you'll be a stand till I die, though. Stand till I die, though. That was sick, bro. What the? Bro, this is the best album he's ever put out. I don't care what anyone says, man. In the Coupe de Gras, I'm cruder than removing claws from a cougar's paws and throw it back in the wild. But you taming me ain't gonna happen. I live on the planet denial, uh, like, uh, denial, like, uh, like the denial river, right? He's saying back into the wild. It's talking about like, like Africa. That's crazy. But you'll be a stand till I die, though. That's crazy. You'll be a stand till I die. That's true, guys. Uh, he could even be talking about MGK there. Till I die. Stan was a perform uh, was a song performed by Eminem, and and uh, Dido of course Stan. But Stan Till I Die is also he could be making fun of MGK there as well because obviously MGK has a song called Till I Die, uh, Cleveland Till I Die or whatever. Man, that was the best song ever. Every song on this album was the best song ever. This is a ridiculous album, bro. Like oh my days, bro. This album was ridiculous, man. Head honcho. Let me know your thoughts, man. Ten out of ten, of course. I'm the biggest stand of all time, guys. Let me know your thoughts, and I'll see you guys all in the next one, man. Peace.